guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Lacey and if you're a turn subscriber, welcome back. So today we're going to be doing my June favourites. So if you want to see what I love in the month of June, including makeup, skincare, hair care, body care, TV shows, YouTubers, literally everything, just keep on watching. So what I'm going to be talking about first is skincare. So during the month of May, May? It's June. Oh my God. So some skincare bits that I've been loving during the month of June is the Garnier range. So as you should know from my last May favourites video, um, I absolutely am obsessed with this Garnier range, but I use the pink version. So when I seen that they had like a yellow version, I had to pick it up. So this is honey flower, uh, honey flower and honey flower. So yeah, it's the honey flower range. Um, the other one was the rose water range, but honestly, it's just so so affordable. These range between like three to six euro, and they are available in Butler's Medical Hall, which is in Wicklow Town. The first up is the toner. This is the Nourishing Botanical Toner with Honey Flower for dry to very dry skin. So this is literally only new out. It says here new, uh, but I've been loving this recently as my toner, and I've been using it every day for the past like three weeks, and. There's literally barely anything gone from it. So next up we have the cleansing milk and I've just absolutely been loving this so so much to take off my makeup It is just brilliant. So last from the Garnier range is the day cream which I've been loving recently I just think it's absolutely amazing. It really really is So if you have kind of dry skin and just want to try out this range, I would highly highly recommend it. It's so affordable So the next product I'll be talking about kind of is like skincare um, and it is the face halo if you've watched my vlog last week, which I will link up here, you should go check out. Um, I got this in Boots. It was nine euro, I think. Yeah, I think it was nine euro. So the concept of this is it's like a reusable, non-toxic, recyclable makeup remover. So I've used it a good few times and honestly, it is insane. My only problem that I've had with it is I just like don't know how to clean it really. Like it does have instructions how to clean it um, and it says just put it in the washing machine, but like in my house, I don't know about you guys, but when I put it in the washing like machine basket, I don't see it for about two weeks or maybe I'll never see it again. So I'm not risking that. So I've just been washing it in the sink. And like, yeah, they are clean, but they're just kind of stained. But honestly, the first time I tried this, I was just completely like in awe. I was like, this is not real. So all you do is put warm water on it and just go like that. And all my makeup was gone. Like it was all gone. There was no going back in. It was gone. It was just really, really crazy. And I just was blown away. I was very, very impressed. If you want to join me and help the environment, I'd highly recommend the face halo. Just so much better for the environment. I'd highly recommend you look into it. So the next product is a tanning product. If you saw me on Instagram, which you should if you don't, the day I got this, I put it on my story and was saying how much I was excited to try it. And um, so yeah, follow me. <laughs> well. Do you ever just say something you're just like, ew, why did you just say that? So this product is absolutely insane. This is a tan eraser from Tanologist. Honestly, I've only tried this once or twice. Um, and when I first put it on, so you put it on before the shower, leave it for five minutes and then get into the shower. And you know most tan erasers when you do that, you get into the shower, you have to kind of scrub. When I say I step into the shower and my tan just fell off me. Like, you know, when you just apply tan, you get a shower and all the tan comes off. When I use this, that happened to my tan. So I'd highly recommend this if you struggle to get that nasty tan off. So the next item I was kindly gifted and I'm just, I love it so, so much. I'm not just saying that I don't get commission or anything on this, so it's honestly just my views. So this is from an Irish brand called Sprawls. If you follow my Instagram again, you already know about this. I've tried a few times about it. It's just the coolest way to be able to carry around a perfume in your bag. Like no one wants to bring around a big chunky perfume. I know I wouldn't anyway. And it's just so, so cool. So you literally just take the cap off the perfume, pop that onto it and just pump it. And it's just absolutely brilliant. These are so, so affordable. Like, and I always have like deals on, it's like two for three. No, three for two. Sorry, oh my God, I'm so bad at math. It's just absolutely brilliant. I love it so, so much. And it is just always in my bag. I also have a discount code, which is Lucy25 for 25% off your entire order, which is bloody brilliant considering they're so cheap anyway. So get on it. Okay, so now we're moving on to makeup. And first up is the Wonder Skin Illuminating Primer. If you haven't seen my shop Miss A haul, go check it out. This is bloody brilliant. It is very thick and smells like sun cream and very tacky. And at first I was like, oh, 
but I swear to God, my foundation has never stuck so brilliantly to my face. Like it literally is just amazing. This was $1, so about 83 cent. Brilliant, absolutely brilliant. They also do one in a perfecting blur primer, but I haven't tried that yet. So if this is good, it will be my July favorites, but if it's not, must be shit. So next up is another product from Shop Miss A. And when I say that this product is phenomenal, I don't, I'm not just saying that. Like I think this is, let me just shut up and show you the product. So this is the product. This is the buildable satin foundation. I have it in the shade Soft Tan. When I say this is the best foundation I've ever tried in my life, I mean it. Like this is amazing. And like, I know this is such a feature of the foundation that it shouldn't be a big deal but the dropper works brilliantly. And you think any foundation that has a dropper should work, but trust me, a lot of them don't. But this is absolutely brilliant. The coverage is so, so beautiful. It is so buildable. It is just honestly, it has just changed my makeup game. I'm actually wearing it today. That's my foundation on. It is just phenomenal, it really is. I would highly, highly recommend this. I'm so gonna repurchase it because they are quite small bottles. Um, and I don't care waiting a month for it. And the next time I order off Shop Miss A, I'm going to order like maybe 20 of these because they're only 150 each. And I'm not kidding saying that. They're brilliant. And I'll get them in every shade as well for my clients. So yeah. <laughs> Does anyone else have a list on their notes of like all makeup on their, their wish list? Well, one of these products has been on my wish list for a very long time. I've no idea who I've seen using it, but Anyway, I just needed to have it. Um, and it is the e.l.f. concealer, but it has to be the hydrating concealer. So the person said, whoever I seen that had it. But this is just genuinely such a good concealer. It is so, so full coverage. So if you don't like the feel of a heavy concealer, this isn't for you. But I really, really love this. This is in the shade Fair Warm, I think. Fair Warm. But yeah, it is so, so brilliant, so affordable, and I highly recommend it. This is the Hydrating Camo Concealer Satin Finish. I highly recommend. So next up, I got the same concealer, just in a different shade. So I got this one in Deep Caramel. That's what it looks like. I've actually no idea why it has them marks in it though. It's very weird, but it doesn't come off like any marks in real life. Um, and these have a huge doe fat. Is that what it's called? A doe fat? Doe fat? I don't fucking know, but a huge applicator. It is absolutely massive. So I use this as a liquid contour. I don't know why, but just cream products have just been speaking to me recently. So the next item is a liquid blush from MUA Makeup Academy. Honestly, I've never looked up or down at this brand before. It's available in Superdrug. I don't know why, I've just never ever looked at it. Um, but I've seen this and it just intrigued me because I do have a lot of liquid blushes, but they're just so bloody expensive. Like I use the Charlotte Tilbury Peach Gas, I that was called. Um, but it just ran out so, so fast. Like I used it like 10 times and it was like, oh God. So this is in the shade Tiger Lily and honestly, it is something else. This is like my favorite liquid blush I've ever tried and it is just so, so cheap. And it is available in Superdrug if you're interested. Oh, by the way, it's like orange, orange kind of blush, but it blends out so, so nice. So next up is another item from Shop Miss A and this is their Lumi Radiant Blush. It is so, so fab. It really, really is. Like, look at that. Oh my God. This is in the shade Ravish. And then that's what I have on to... I don't. I actually don't have one. I don't. It is just so, so beautiful. Again, it was like one euro, so you can't go wrong. Um, it just gives the most luminous luminous glow so yeah it is absolutely gorgeous and i highly recommend it so next up is a product i've wanted to try for so long but i just don't know why i didn't so this is the p louise Bada black base i am so so impressed with it this retails for 14 euro in butler's medical hall in wicklow you can get it online really anywhere i'm also sure laura malone academy stocks this you should go check that out but honestly this is just such an amazing product i've never ever tried um you know, like smoky eyes before i just feel like they're really really scary you know people pack so much black shadow and then blend them out that just gives me anxiety um but this honestly made it so, so easy. I will insert a picture here of a look that I created using the base. I was very, very impressed with it as I really thought I could never do an eyeshadow like that. So next up is an item I quickly talked about on my Instagram story a few days ago. And this is a makeup palette or just a palette really. You can have it for anything. And this was kind of gifted by a girl called Nails by Alyssa. She's a nail tech from Dublin. So this is just the most beautiful thing ever. It goes in my room so, so well. But that is just the most stunning thing I've ever 
ever seen. So what you'd use this for is you can mix your foundations on it, that's what I've done today. Um, or you could do your 77 gel line or your jewel line mix thing, you can mix colours on this. This would be great for lash techs. This could be a bloody coaster. A coaster. This could be really, really anything, or just if you're really into stuff like this, you can just have it in your room for decoration. But what I'm going to be using it as is a mixing palette. So these retail for 10 euro and an extra 3 euro for shipping. And of course, it's an Irish owned business. So you should really go check her out. Thank you so much, Alyssa, for sending me this over. And I wish you the best in your business. Next up is the So Sue Lashes for Days. Look at this. Look at that. It's amazing. So you get so much lashes in that I unfortunately lost that pair, which I was raging about because I had actually been wearing them with no makeup on. They just look like minks. They were absolutely fab. So in this, you get 12 pairs of eyelashes, a lash applicator and a lash glue. And if you haven't tried the Sosu Lash Glue, it's probably one of the best on the market in my opinion. So in this set, you get a mix between natural lashes to very, very full glam. So I managed to grab this at 25 euro. Uh, they're always on sale. They're also available in the pharmacy across from the tennis court in Wicklow. They have this on sale in there as well. If they have some left, I'm not sure. But honestly, I love Sosu Lashes. They're brilliant. I've used a few of them already and I just think for that price, you can't really say no. So next up is a pair of lashes from the amazing brand AJM Luxury Lashes. So this is what the packaging looks like. They're so, so nice. You just pull it out, it's like a little drawer. Beautiful diamonds in behind it. Honestly, the packaging for this is just A+. plus. I have never seen anyone do packaging like this before. It's very, very unique. So I'm actually an AJM brand ambassador. So I actually have a code for 10% off, which is Lucy10. The lashes I've been loving this month is the style Chanel. I actually have them on right now. They're just so, so beautiful. They really, really are. Look at them. You can't look at them lashes and tell me they're not insane. And honestly, I'm not just saying that these lashes are amazing because I'm an ambassador. I only got to be an ambassador because I love these lashes so much. So I'd highly recommend you check out this brand, AGM Luxury Lashes, and they can be used up to 28 times if you take good care of them, and they retail for $11.95. So I'd highly recommend you check them out. They're also an Irish brand, which is a plus. So next up is probably one of my favourite things ever, and there's this beautiful bag from Primark slash Pennies. Isn't it just the most beautiful thing you've ever seen? It is so, so mini, but it has so much room in it. And it also has a strap that you can clip back on. I'll just show you as it now. Like seriously, tell me this isn't one of the most thrilling bags you've ever seen, like ever. I just feel like such a fashionista with it. Just all my bags are way too like, fancy for every day. Even though this bag looks quite fancy, when I have no makeup on and just have like leggings or something on, this is just so, so stunning just to wrap around your shoulder. Gorgeous. It was only a tenner. 10 bloody euro for this absolute icon of a bag. I love it so, so much. So if it's gonna be near pennies anytime soon, check that out. So another item that I've been loving for the month of May. May? It's not May, it's fucking June. So another item that I've been loving for the month of June is my anti-glue light glasses. This is what they look like. They're honestly so, so stunning. If you follow me on Instagram, you would see me wearing these probably every single day. So I've actually kindly gifted these and Honestly, I wear them every single day. Aren't they just absolutely gorgeous? So these are anti-blue light glasses from the brand Aqualist. Uh, I think that's how you pronounce it, Aqualist, Aqualast. I don't know, I really don't know how to pronounce anything. Um, but anyway, they protect your eyes from the harsh blue light that comes from your laptop, your phone, anything like that really. Do you know you just get that splitting headache from being on your phone too long? Honestly, if you wear these, you won't get it anymore. And I'm not just saying that because I'm working with these guys, but bloody hell, these work so, so well. From wearing these guys, I have not got a headache from editing or being on my phone. I have been getting much better sleep and I'm not just saying that, honestly. I literally go to sleep like that, genuinely. I never used to be like that. And of course, they just look absolutely stunning. They have a 30 day mini back guarantee. You just can try out and you can return them within 30 days if you're not impressed with them. Um, but genuinely, I can't see anyone returning them because once you get them, you're gonna see that they work. I have a discount code, which is LucyC10. I will insert it here and that gets you 10% off your order. And I do make commission off that just so that you guys know, but yeah. Insane, absolutely insane. Try them out yourself and let me know if you love them. So during the month of June, I actually haven't watched anything new. I am just a very, very, I don't know. I'm just very weird. I am very, very weird. I only like watching TV shows that I've seen before. Um, so I'm currently watching The Vampire Diaries for the fifth time. 
but if anyone has any recommendations for TV shows, please leave them below and I will check them out and then I can let you know next month what I taught them. But one thing I've been watching a lot more of is YouTube and who I have been loving on YouTube the last month is Jordan Lipscomb. But I just enjoy watching Jordan so, so much. I've actually watched her for, oh God, years, absolute years. But I just stopped watching her for some reason. I just became very uninterested in her. And I just said I would watch one of her videos like two weeks ago. And when I say I've watched like her last 30 videos, I mean that like I am obsessed with her. I don't know what turned me off for like a few years ago, but I am back in love with her. And she is just a brilliant content creator and absolutely stunning. And she just, it's, she's one of those YouTubers that when she's sitting there doing her makeup and chatting, it really feels like you're just sitting where if that makes sense and um, she's just absolutely amazing and i'd highly recommend you check out her youtube so guys that is the end of my june favorites video i really, really hope you like this video and comment below what you love during the month of june and i'd love to check them out so guys if you like this video please like share and subscribe and hit that notification bell so you'll never miss when i upload have an amazing day guys stay safe stay kind and i will see you in the next one bye mm -hmm.